The sales experience has been invaluable. There's probably nothing that could have better prepared me to help co-found Fenwick. The reason is when you're in sales, you have maybe the best perspective of anybody of how businesses work because how they work is how they make money. And you're there to figure out how to help your company make money by helping other companies make money. And that view on everything I find is absolutely unique. And I find that it's something that's not shared when you start in a different department that is just one of the pieces. Sales has no choice but to understand everything. If you're the one selling the software, you're running into the product team's office saying, guys, we need a feature. And you're having to learn how difficult it is for them to think about adding that feature in when they're prioritizing an entire roadmap. You have to work with marketing which is how I got my start going down to the marketing team saying, Hey, I've got this one client. Can we please get an article up to show them that we understand them? And the marketing team saying, listen, you have no idea how much we have going on. Here's a pen. Why don't you do it yourself? So this is the best training for understanding yeah. all of that. And also on helping to find new business and qualify new business. And I feel like the place that I got the best training was at the last company that I was at, which is Marketo where we had a lot of inbound interest because the marketing, the product were so good. It allowed me to finally practice real sales. And I really got to feel the luxury of having enough inbound interest to realize my job was not to get anybody possible to sign the contracts, but the right people to sign the contracts. And that has directly affected how we've tried to build Fenwick, which is we do a lot of qualifying upfront to make sure that it's actually going to do what they hope it does. Yep. 